everybody, it's Mina. Welcome back to my channel. Or if this is the very first video that you're seeing of me, then welcome to my channel. Please be sure to hit that subscribe button down below if you didn't already. I post every day of the week while on today in this video. I'm going to tell you guys a story about how I accidentally came to school early when I wasn't supposed to. So this is just to teach you guys to always pay attention to the school schedules if you have a later start than normal. And at this time, I had no concept of time still. I didn't have any time management skills. I still kind of don't have time management skills, but I'm getting a little better. I'm practicing. So um, I didn't have, I've gotten, so I back then I just didn't have time management skills. And this is just to teach you guys to always pay attention to your schedule if you have a later start than normal. Because like it's hard when your schedule changes, I know, especially nowadays, because even though you're not going to school, it's still hard when your schedule changes because um, you're just so hooked on that routine of when you're going to school, but school, well, and, but when it changes, it just throws you off. So I definitely was thrown off by this change. And this was only, um, this was only um, just for when we were having a testing week. So I'm going to get started. And if you guys have ever claimed to come to school early when you weren't supposed to, just comment down below. Below, like, why were you having a late start at school? And why, what, or why were you not going, or why did you, um, okay, so anyway, so comment down below if you had a late start for school and you forgot. Tell me what you did. Did you just go home and wait to leave till later, or did you just go to another classroom to do something while you waited for school to start? Comment down below. So I'm going to get started. So this all started when I was a freshman in high school. Um, I was going to, I came to school because I think my stepdad had dropped me off because I wasn't walking to school at the time because my, um, I don't know why my parents were just dropping me off at school because I think they wanted me to be more comfortable with high with the high school because I didn't know how to any directions to walk to my high school school and my parents weren't letting me walk home alone because they were worried about me me because sometimes I have a bad habit of I had a back then I had a bad habit of not paying attention to cars very well well so they would just draw me off and my stepdad dropped me early me off at school at my normal time but I forgot to I'm sorry, I thought the camera went blurry. I forgot to tell him that it was testing for seniors and sophomores. So I go into school and my teacher's like, are you a sophomore? Are you? And this teacher comes up to me, not my teacher, excuse me. One of the teachers comes up to me and goes, are you a sophomore or senior? I'm like, I'm a freshman. They're like, you're not supposed to be here. Blah, 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 blah. It's testing. Can you call somebody to pick you up? up and I'm like I don't have my cell phone and the, so the school calls my stepdad and they're like oh she's not supposed to be here it's here it's it's testing for only seniors here's a sophomore so he's like oh, okay I'll go and get her and I'm not sure if he sounded happy sounded unhappy on the phone but when we got to school when he came to school he was like happy that the teacher had told him what had happened and happened and why I was at school and he seemed kind of happy but then when I got in the car my stepdad was pretty mad at me he's like why didn't you tell me you had a had um it was you weren't supposed to be at school early I'm like I forgot I'm sorry I forgot this week was testing for seniors and sophomores they told they said they gave you a note that you had to be at school at 10 o'clock blah 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 why didn't you tell me I me mean, I'm like I'm really sorry <laughs> and he's like you need to start paying attention to your schedule Mina Blah, 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 blah. That is not really good that you didn't know that you weren't supposed to be at school school early. I'm pretty mad. Blah, 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 blah. Well, and I think he was at home. He was at home that day, which is pretty good because um, then I could get a ride to school. So anyway, so we go home. I sit at home for like a couple, for like an hour or so. And I'm like hanging out at home and I'm worried about going to school. And my stepdad's like, they just told you that you had, you weren't supposed to be there because it was so seniors and sophomores doing retakes, blah, 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 blah. You were supposed to be at there 11. 11, blah, 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 blah. Blah, and because, well, uh, and the reason why I was doing this, because I wasn't used to that schedule. I was used to my original school schedule being at school at 7.35 because that was the time my school started. Started, and I wasn't used to the change in the schedule, so I was completely thrown off. 
knobs because for those who don't know if I have a certain schedule I like to stick with that schedule and that schedule just really helps me be more motivated to do things but if I don't have a schedule it just throws my whole day off I don't know why it's one of my weird habits I have have so we sit at home I eat some mango that was cut up and then and then um, my um, stepdad takes me to school when it's like around 11, when it's like 1030 so he drives me to school and school and he goes have school and he is still a little irritated to me irritated because of what happened earlier and I did apologize to him for what had happened he's like that's okay but next time pay attention to your schedule and so he takes me back to school and I go into school and just forget about what happened that morning so the moral of the story is always pay attention to your schedule if you have a later start in a normal Norm, normal that day like let's say you start school at 10 o'clock when you were supposed to start when you normally start at 8 stick with that schedule starting at school at 10 o'clock because then um it shows that you're more prepared with your time management and it shows that you're paying attention to what is going on and if you get to school really really early when you're not supposed to be at school early just go early just ask somebody for help and see what time you're supposed to be at school when you're not supposed to be and then if it's like earlier than you're supposed to be just go home and then wait till it's the time to leave but the important thing is to always pay attention to your school schedule and if you're a senior and a sophomore and senior or a sophomore in high school and you have to take a test at a certain time write that down in your planner i never wrote that stuff down in my planner because i literally get we didn't have any time management skills back then back then and if you yeah so just so you know if you're forgetful about times you're supposed to be at school write it down so then you don't forget yeah, so that was the story of how i accidentally went to school early when i wasn't supposed to i hope you guys enjoyed the video thank you so much for watching please be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already i post every day of the week for all and i'll see you in our video soon bye